coming them up. Please follow through Broken Blade, right? Like, that, you're going to have the follow-up there. So, uh, I, you know, I think this all works out pretty well. Leon Nautilus, I've seen this 100,000 times. <laughs> you know, you can interrupt each other's engages and, you know, kind of disengage together. Yeah, and I find these two drafts very curious. Uh, RNGs, I think, is a, a little bit more standard in terms of you have a lot of different options you can play out. Like, they, they have a strong 5v5. They have the Ezreal to, to carry. They have great front line in the Gwen and the Leona. They have some pick potential in sides with the fact that they will have both Ari and Gwen there as composed of Vlad has ultimate up, still has W and Ghost as well. Is it going to be enough? There's Ghost. Disjoints the Q damage, jumps towards the wall. Flash kick is beautiful. Big heal comes in, Ignite on. Broken Blade will get shut down. Way burns the cooldowns and burns the top part of the ground. I love the confidence coming out. He's still gonna posture for this at least. We can see on the minimap, Shao who's moving down. Ult doesn't hit though. Yeah, no ult for anyone right now. Every single thing is down. Aftershock is on. They're just gonna burn Ming to the ground. Flacken dives away. They're gonna trade one back at least, but still well done by the G2 bot lane. 1v3. Shao goes in. A flash get away. Wei can't find the Q just yet. He's gonna get it at the end. Oh, How about the rest? Caps cannot land it, but the turret will. Minions are in the place. Now Caps has his own flash, has an extra one to chase down. Will he go for it? Health oh. bar is low. One more auto will kill him. The kick back. Though, does Shahu have enough? There was the question. Caps gonna try for more battle stars. Shahu very low on mana is a thing. It's gonna be an auto attack fight now. So Caps, oh, if that sleep landed, he might have gotten the kill here. Shahu now gonna maybe walk away. Battle star will not quite kill. Good sidestep. Yankos on the way. He's stealth. And a flash of safety knew that. Hold on, this could be a threat. Well done by Caps buying the time, forcing a flash out of Shahu. Constantly seeing Caps be the difference. Play, hits the electrocute, dodges out oh. from Shaohu, and that's how he's able to get it done. That Q not landing, a really big deal. Caps kept going to the right. I don't know if he was predicted juke or not, but either way, Sonic Wave's not going to come through. Wait! Oh, oh, man! Caps is just so damn good. Yankos gets away. The clone helps tank some of Shaohu's damage. True shot barrage! Woo! He felt that on his tail. He was so close. I, 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 Azale said it the other day on Dive for you that Caps has been the best performing minute lead paid back by the top jungle of RNG so we do see the scoreboard it's a tied game here just sort of marketing like who's got the leads right it's, it's caps big up for G2 it's the top side big up for RNG and they're gonna try again right here three four versus one broken blade what can you immune they're gonna walk up for the stun then chain everything W comes down Ming has the turret dagger has to walk away at night good stopwatch finds the kill and turrets uh, will just switch back to the minions so a well played die by RNG they lose a stopwatch for it but the kill is worth it as now G2 fight to the side and I mean they are a thousand damage away from Shelly finishing the turret for them. Yeah, just really nice cross mapping coming out from the side of G2. They realize they can't look for this. Go down towards the bottom side. They don't need to commit caps. So it looks like caps is being ganked right now. Yes. Yeah, so there comes the damage, but he's going to be just fine. Targetus being a lot of space there as well. Caps going to trade back on the gallop. Targetus will go down. Oh. No, the flash to safety. 15 health left. And Shao, who cannot find that kill. First turret went to G2, traded back by Bin, but the Herald charge went on a bot too. That's going to be like 800 gold waiting to be claimed. Pretty soon by Broken Blade or Yankos. And, uh, I, I think Way can get in and get out if he wants to go for the smite fight. Down to 900. Claimed. Well done by Caps. And now we look at round two. That's going to be Gwen coming in. Drowsy, though, in melee range. Caps ignited but finds the root. He keeps running away. And now he's left alone. Nicely done by Black. He jumps right in. And Broken Blade gets his revenge. Dragon, kill number one. Looking for number two as well. In again, Broken oh. Blade. Sets up a lot of space. They get number two. That sweep might make it hard to run away now as well. RNG is going to go ahead and walk away, lick at their wounds. G2 getting everything they wanted. Yeah, G2 taking the fight. 35 ping, it's one frame. Like that, that's the timing. So, uh, pretty reliable to get away from that one. And now, Ben gonna jump right in, sees Black at no CC, but maybe baits him in anyway. And now, as deep as gonna cross, will it be enough? Zoe's in melee range and finds kill number one. And there's no way out. Shao is death number two. RNG tried way too hard to kill themselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was such a confusing play coming out from RNG. Ben going in saying, hey, Shao can follow up as a TP. And RNG still posturing, might find this. Yeah, combos it out. Nicely done away, gets the Gore Trigger and the E across. So at least one kill traded back, good solo. But of course, two to one, still in the extended play. G2 feeling good, and Shelly, well, that's gonna be second turret. Yeah, G2 should be able to get this one. RNG gonna have to rotate up to stop a second charge from being able to come through. They'd already cleared the wave in mid, so not too much ring on this front, but a TP coming out from Bin. Oh, they're gonna try yet again, all right. Okay, if you don't succeed, oh, way! I think that was purely blind, beautifully done. Solo kill on a flacket. Majai is picked up for caps. That's exciting. No other kills. Yeah, Majai. I love the confidence. Play on mid, but he kind of wants to be in a flank spot in the first place. Both are good spots. Okay, I know where the back line has gone. We know what's going on there. Ming not spotted. A kick from behind. Really? Ooh. Just beautiful by way. They will sack the dragon.
But until it turns into soul, the kills probably were more. Mid? Yeah, exactly. Mid pressure is a thing. They can rush down this turret, and a kill in a turret is better than second dragon. Yeah, 100% RNG. Really nice play there. I can empathize with what both teams are doing, right? G2. I mean, they couldn't contest mid uh, mid wave. They had to go through bots. That's how they found their avenue onto. The Fast. I mean, 1800 damage together. Way might spot it soon. Q over the wall. Sees it. Time is gonna be tight. Double spike. Oh, they don't go for it. He gets it in time. He goes able to claim it. Out goes way. That was nearly a barren snipe, but it's not gonna happen. A good sneak all the same. Cap's gonna walk away cleanly. Xiao who cannot really get in. Keep in mind, they still got Gwen pushed to the bottom side. Bot lane outer is down. We'll attack tier two as Broken Blade attempts to answer. Exactly. Just pulling up Gwen. There is no threat on you whatsoever. And Gwen is like seen on the wave. So Wei could engage a 4v5. It'll be Ming doing it. But Ming just explodes. Now he gets okay, out. Goes. Gallop finds one. And they're gonna go for a little bit more. Now where's the kick gonna be? Where's Broken Blade running away? Targamus, no flat kick. Gonna get out just barely. A nice kick. But that's one already picked up under the Gwen. As Vin does show with the TP. Coming on for the rest of it. The sleep is there. And Wei will fall. Look at that, four versus three on the map. G2 still just taking more. Yeah, they still bear. They can still look to keep pushing down these objectives. RG in a really bad place. Caps now picking up the flash. I'm on edge, Freak. I'm on edge. I mean, they're getting so much done, though. G2 playing on the edge at this point. Knock another turret down. Broken Blade, a small ping towards him. Getting farther and farther ahead. 4,000 now. Is going fine. Mid lane is going fine. We saw Caps get around, and now 1v1, Bin and Broken Blade. Bin just, Ooh. just a bleeding. Oh, oh, Bin is not close, but Flack it in for a bit more. The flash safety is not going to happen for anything, so Shadow's going to come back in, finds the charm, but can't get any more done because Yankos is here, who wants to find that knockup, cannot do so. Shadow so gets out. One for one, both top laners die. Resources were funneled into Bin. He's trying to show me. Passive. Broken Blade's gonna be able to heal up nice and fine. And Caps and Black and really never in hard way. Season. Wants to go in, gonna find the charm. Oh, oh there's the first stop. Watch burn. But Caps doesn't have an easy way out. Has a real flash. Gets over the wall, but they get him. They get the shutdown. One for one so far. That was been has been destroyed. Broken Blade gonna take a bit of damage. Will walk out, but without Caps, that's 10 stacks off the Majai. He was at 14. And I believe this should be RNG having control over the bottom river now. Smite down for way. Burns it on Scuttle, but it's gonna be the short cooldown. Targum has slowed down. Nearly killed. Gala. Can't go in for a whole lot more, but now they know they forced G2 away. 30 seconds still on this dragon, but that would be able to take the fight. Yeah, because at half, though, was a bit of a danger. Way sticking around there. 4k health on Bear, and they have to be careful about this timing here. Ben, going to be here soon enough, and G2 flinch. They say, we're not really going to play for this. We're not really going to flip it. Yanko so low, oh, jumps Shadow. the wall. That's a huge stun. They're going to knock down Xiao, who rooted in place, and Caps gets his revenge. Broken Blade, so he's, but Broken Blade may not have a way out. They get him back again. Soul laner's dead now once each on both sides. The re-engage gives a crash, shut down into Gala. Min gonna be next. The bot lane is in shambles. A double for Yanko, so now they're gonna go for a little bit more. And Flack gonna just free fire on the bin. Another death onto the Gwen, and G2 gonna get the Baron after all. And Flack is repositioning in these fights with that ultimate, and his flash have been so beautiful to make sure he doesn't go down. G2, like you said, are gonna get the Baron. I love that Caps is still hunting for way and G2 just continuing to run through with these fights. Rookies, man. 22-year-old rookie, but a rookie nonetheless. This man is so good. Flacken is outstanding and has been all No, we are aiming for a trophy. We're aiming for more titles. They were willing to do it. And at least so far, it's only best of ones, but it's paying off against the best teams in the world. Yeah, and they have looked impressive. Nice kickback, though. Could be a kill, but Yanko's had his stopwatch. Way will not yet die, but the charm lands. Shahu's there. Back into the air. Tries to get the spells off, and they will get one from Ben. Now Gala <laughs> running for his life. There's been so many narrow margins, but RNG get the one for zero and have time to reset. That's the one thing you got to give RNG in this game so far. They've always looked for the angle to find the engage, to find the pick. Way constantly waiting behind G2 to find these kicks into the rest of his engage. Jumps right on in. A lot of damage. Target with Blades gets so oh, wow. does. Beautiful start here. Will it be enough for the rest of it? Broken Blade trying to buy some time. Ming going to jump right back out. We'll stay alive. But Ben has to be careful. Going right back in. Will come for the knockup on a one. Stopwatch burn. And down goes Xiaohu. Will they trade it back? Yo, he's healing. He's staying oh, alive. Two shot barrage. Gala stays alive. Cap finds one way on the way out. Has a guardian angel though. Flash in. It's going to be enough for Caps. Burns the Zonia's outer glass yet again. Gala played to his limits, but ignited and falls. And G2 mopped the floor with RNG. What was essentially a 4v5. G2 
Ruth, you are able to turn it around. Great play coming out from Yankos. Flacken, once again, is so damn fearless, just constantly going in. He had the GA, he knew he was fine, and they took RNG down. Absolutely beautiful. If you want to see what the best team in the world plays like, you better.